Please subscribe our channel and press the win button for latest videos and updates. Why is the rum always gone? Hello friends, hopefully you all are doing well. Today we are going to tell you about top 10 movies of Johnny Depp. On number 10, we have Corpse Bride. Johnny Depp is not a stranger to animated movies, and while his lead role in the film Rango was one of his best, the fans on Internet Movies Database prefer the Tim Burton and Mike Johnson directed Corpse Bride. The film is a stop motion film that is seen as a spiritual sequel to The Nightmare Before Christmas and sees Johnny Depp star as Victor, while Helena Carter stars as Emily, a zombie who believes she is a Victor's corpse bride. On number 9, we have Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them Johnny Depp's roles in the Harry Potter prequel Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them was not only minimal, but it was hidden and not revealed until the end. He had a massive role in the second movie in the franchise, as he began his war against the world of magic and muggles. But it was the first movie that receives the most praise by fans on the internet. Number 8. Nightmare on Elm Street as with many young stars of his era, Johnny Depp got his first significant break in a horror movie. Depp was one of the kids haunted by the evil Freddy in the first of Nightmare on Elm Street movie. Depp is the boyfriend of Nancy, the man protagonist of the first film of the franchise. However, being Nancy's beloved boyfriend is not the best thing to be in a nightmare movie. When Glenn falls asleep, he was the next to die in an impressive scene where his entire mattress followed him. On number 7, Dead Man. While Johnny Depp has worked with Tim Burton more than almost an actor, he has also worked with some of Hollywood's most eccentric directors, including John Waters, Cry Baby, and Jim, who directed Depp in a Dead Man. Depp stars as a Cleveland accountant who travels by a train to a frontier town for a job. He is then driven out of that town by the owner of the company. After he kills an attacker in the self-defense, he flees into the wilderness where he meets a Native American named Nobody and runs from man trying to kill him. On number 6, we have Blow. Except for Jam Berry's, most of the Johnny Depp's biographical roles are outlaws. George Chang is at the top of that list. In Blow, he takes on the part of the guy who helped bring cocaine into America. He does it with the swagger of a rock star. Number 5. Donnie Bresco. In what a lot of people in the industry would say was Depp's first real grown-up role, he picked a dozy playing the real-life FBI agent. The movie has Depp at the top of the game. He acted across, who took on the role of Lefty, the aging mobster who fell for the act, let Donnie in and eventually got taken down by the FBI. Number 4. What's Eating Gilbert Grape? When Depp sets his mind, to a dramatic role. He is one of the best actors in the game. What's eating Gilbert Grape is a prime example. There are no quiz, no makeup to hide behind. Depp was just a young actor, portraying a young man with a tremendous burden, caring for his family in small town America. On number 3, we have Ed Wood. The Burton Depp friendship has always yielded positive results. Sometimes their movies are more mainstream. Sometimes they are at work. Movie buffs knew who was the Sherlock monster was before Depp played him. But after a lot of more people knew about one of the worst directors that ever lived. Despite his lack of talents, Wood never gave up on any of his dreams. Depp's wild-eyed enthusiasm helped create a charismatic look at the director. On number two, we have Pirates of the Caribbean. One of you old. Captain Jack Madden was over 15 years ago when Disney decided to make a movie out of its long beloved Pirates ride. Pirates of the Caribbean, Curse of the Black Pearl was the result. The film on paper was nothing more than a good old pirate movie that might have been okay. But Depp took the role of Captain Jack Sparrow and made him something wholly unique, at least for a Disney movie. The result was an Academy Award nominated performance and the star of a franchise. On number 1, we have Platoon. 
The movie that sits at the top of all Johnny Depp movies is one of one that most people might not even remember him staring in. Released in 1986, the 23-year-old babyface Depp appeared in the Oliver Stone masterpiece Platoon. The movie was the first of three films directed by Stone that focused on the Vietnam War and showed young men sent into a battle that no one understood. Depp was a young soldier named Lerner who worked with the aggressive and violent Pauls, whose actions caused them to destroy an entire village of innocent people.